ZFHP is a series of the 8-speed transmissions with the ZF brand. In 2008, it was showcased for the first time. Since 2009, gearboxes had been widely used in almost the whole range of BMW models. Then their modified versions were applied in front-wheel drive and all-wheel drive Audi A7, A8, and Q5. Besides the mentioned car makes, such gearboxes can also be found on the local market in Jaguar, Land Rover, and Range Rover. The Chrysler Company equips its autos with the slightly upgraded analog of ZF8HP, marking it as an 845RE. What we're going to talk about today is the repair of a ZF 8-speed transmission valve body. Let's begin from testing. We have a new stand, enabling us to completely imitate operation of the valve body, as if it's installed in automatic gearbox, and a mechanic can see the real-time operation of the hydraulic system and solenoids. Such a method of testing allows performing much more detailed diagnostics compared to simple testing by means of a vacuum stand. Because there are some problems, valves jamming, or solenoids malfunction, that occur only after warm-up. We'll be testing on the stand detected wear of a main pressure valve boost sleeve, as it is the trouble spot of all ZF gearboxes from the 4-speed to the 9-speed models. The following warning signs can help to identify the boost sleep failure. Diagnostics detects high pressure errors. The transmission kicks when shifting into drive mode. If the boost sleeve is in good condition, but the valve itself is worn out, shifting into the drive mode will be too sluggish. We'll replace it with a new one. Besides, the 8 HP valve bodies have problems with the end plugs. If the vacuum drops to 16 inch HG or lower, pressure losses will be unavoidable that will initially cause jerks and vice versa slow shifting, which can end up burning clutch kits. They should be mandatorily checked and, if necessary, replaced with new ones. We'll test the valve body by means of the vacuum stand and detect a problem with the TC pressure valve. The vacuum is very low. The only way out is to replace the valve with an oversized one. We'll remove the plug, spring, and valve. For repair of the valve bodies, the one production reamers and oversized valves are used. The oversized valves are made of aluminum and undergo anodized treatment. We then fix the plate onto the drilling machine and drill a hole. When we take the oversized valve, install it and repeat the vacuum test, the result is excellent. Leak proofability is restored. Now let's proceed to the final testing on the stand. Look at the diagrams and make certain of the faultless operation of all solenoids and valves. Mocktrons provides a year's unlimited mileage warranty for valve body repair.